Before we get into the treats, I got a sneakerhead story I want to share. Oh man, I always got a story to it. This your main man, keep it clean, Ray. Coming back with another vid. My feelings hurt. My feelings hurt. And I'm gonna tell you why my feelings hurt. Had a pair of shoes that, whew, I ain't gonna lie, I love these dearly. These are like grail sneakers for me. And they crumbled on me while they was on my feet. I was at work. I pretty much wear these sneakers about two or three times out of the year. Especially around the Independence Day and all that stuff. Matter of fact, let, let, let's just go ahead and pull them up. These right here. These right here. These are the Air Max 95 during Bevel. Um, this is what happened. They crumbled on me. They crumbled on your boy. They crumbled on your boy. They crumbled. It's all up here too. It's all through here. The other one was on the verge. You can kind of see it at the bottom. They coming in. They coming in. If y'all know anybody that can restore your boy kicks back right. See like they look, look, look. How they coming down. Let me know. Send me the person. Put it in the comment section. Like I ain't gonna lie, I need these. I need these back. These are some grills for me. But they crumbled on me. Feeling hurt. I had them on while I was at work too. And good thing I had them on. Um, brought me a pair of them Vomero 5s with me. Uh, just in case. I actually brought them just in case the shoes would have been uncomfortable. Because I've been wearing Vomero 5s so much. And I ain't wore these since last year. I was like, man, let me see. Bring my Vomero 5s too. And I brought them, as you, I'm talking about moving my feet at work, I'm like, man, what's flapping? Oh, Lord, not to me. But it did happen to me, so if it happened to me, it happened to other people, it can happen to you. Uh, and I actually do wear the kicks, I just don't wear them frequently. I just wear them like two times, three times out of the year. So, yeah, that happened. Uh, another story. So, I'm buying these sneakers. I had needed to uh, replace the key fog in my battery. I mean, in my um, the key the key fog from a car. I need to replace the battery. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna go pick up the sneakers, and then it did July third release date for these. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go get the sneakers. Shoot, then I'm gonna go get the battery. How about I left the keys in the car? How about I left the keys in the car? Got the sneakers. Get out looking for my key, like, oh Lord, keys in my cup holder. No, no, I don't even do that. But this how this how the Lord works in mysterious ways. Cause I should have handled my priority first, but because I'm so much of a sneaker head, I put them sneakers first instead of putting that battery for the key fall first. Your boy had to do a maneuvering, had to call up my homie. We had to, he had to, he had to. <laughs> We laughed through this thing, through the phone. I, I, I had to vent about it. We laughed about it. Hey, he was like, hey, bro, I'm on the way. I got you. I said, he was like, hey, go ahead. Hey, if you can find like a little wedge or something, get that. So I'm like, man, let me go in one of these stores, see if they got a Y hanger. Man, I couldn't find a Y hanger. Couldn't find a Y hanger. Target, uh, it was a TJ Maxx, solid. But it was a Lowe's around there. So I was like, yo, bro, I need something to get through my cup. So I ended up. Find this little thing right here, you just pump it up, put it in the window, pump it up, and uh, it give you a little room. So then once, by the time I did it, my homie came, and then, uh, man, I got in the car. Now, mind you, now, I was out there for a good little minute, because I'm over here picking these up as soon as the stove hit, like this a like this a popular release, you know, it really ain't even no popular release, it's just I wanted them and I ain't feel like doing too much back and forth. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna get my key for all too, so. Yeah, they gonna get into this stuff, man. Oh, 
This is a little shirt I had uh, ordered from PacSun, a little Playboy t-shirt. Playboy t-shirt with the dice. I say next time I go to Vegas uh, or some type of casino, I'm gonna rock this. I'm gonna rock this. This is my Playboy gambling. I'm call this my Playboy gambling t-shirt. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, we're gonna toss that over there. And then let's go on get into this show. Like I said, these release on July 3rd. Uh, this is the Almax DN. Uh, it might be a special edition or something like that. So let's see. I'm going to read the colorway for you. Sky blue, shimmy, hyper blue. And uh, of course, they remind me of the OG uh, Almax Plus. We got on the tag made with at least 20% recycled content. Uh, here we go with the recycled content. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, this is what I got. This is what I bought. Something I can just rock around. Kind of like my bow mirrors. I just throw them on feet and just rock them. They get the other one, man. It's still a little uh, recycled content tag. Well, it's coming off anyway. So. Let's get into this shoe right here. Um, interesting model. A uh, couple of colorways that I actually like in this model. I was going by that white and royal blue pair. One time I was in the store and they didn't have my size. So, you know, I ain't really tripped about it. Man, it wasn't no shoe that I thought I would um, order and nothing like that. So I just let it be. And then one time I had, and then one time I actually saw these in the mall on some early stuff, but I don't think they supposed to have release and all like that, and they're kind of cool. But then I left that mall, and then, you know, sneaky head, and then he got to thinking about the sneaker. And you know what, I might go back and go get them. So uh, I ended up going back over there. Of course, they didn't have them on the shelf. So then I was doing my research, trying to find them. Couldn't find them then. Like the blue, they ended up popping up, and then it was like release date on the 3rd. So I was like, July 3rd. So I was like, okay, man, I'm gonna go cop them. So, that's what ended up happening. So, um, like I said, this will be my first Amex DN. I think he debuted on uh, Amex Day uh, 2024 this year. And like I said, they got some colorways. You may like some of them. There's a few of them that I like. Uh, out of all of them, this been my favorite colorway that I've seen. That's why I picked them up. Heard they was mad comfortable. So, you know I'm into that. Um, we got the little... The little one, two, three, four elbow circles on it. Like I said, man, ain't that major, man. No, ain't no leather materials on it. Got like little long mesh and all that little stuff. Of course, like I say, little plastic right here. All this stuff. I kind of like how this is forming because it's forming like a little black and then go all the way up to your dark blue and then all the way kind of up to your sky blue. So it got a nice little arm. Um, Nice little um, vibe to it, you know. And uh, this sneaker gonna forever have a story because of what I just told you. I got locked out my car buying these. I'm the only one in the store. Like, yo, man, I know I ain't just locked my keys in the car. Shit, what he got that battery for? But the irresponsible thing. But like I said, man, my homeboy, he um, came through for me. And then I actually was able to look up and... Uh, Catch this. It was actually the last one they had in Lowe's too. So, and it was a Lowe's and walking distance. I, I'm just walking back and forth, trying to get a little stuff, <laughs> and it ain't no working out, you know. Yeah, man. Hey, of course that heat was beaming on me, so I'm just sweating the whole time, you know. But it's all G, man. You got a little DN on the elbow right there. Al Max DN on the back, you know. All that good stuff, man, Major, man, you know. Uh, I put them on feet, let you see how they cock. I wish they came with some different laces, man. I think that would be cool if they had, like, some sky blue laces with it, too. What y'all think? Or oh, the black just set them off the right way. But, yeah, cool little color. I ain't gonna hold y'all boys up, but, yo, if y'all know, I don't know anybody that can help your boy out. I want the restored. Oh, 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 shoot. Oh, some of the crumbling coming out. All right, yo, I'm going to get to that. I'm going to um, put these on feet. 
Y'all got excuse, I got on white Nike socks, so I don't think it's gonna blend with these that well. But I'm just gonna put them on feet, so y'all just see how they look. You know what I'm saying? What's the money for them? All right. And this has been your main man, Keep It Clean Ray. Appreciate y'all watching my vids. Check out that on feet. Peace.